Today is January 1st, 2024. I have not weighed in quite a while, <laughs> a few weeks anyway, and I'm not expecting good things because I have not been dieting since like the end of October. Um, so yeah, and I've definitely put some weight back on and I'm super freaking swollen with, uh, inflammation and today is the day that I'm going to start trying to take better care of myself again. <laughs> um, having, um, a nice low carb meal for dinner tonight. Happy new year. <laughs> All right. Let's see if I can even get up. Because I'm in a lot of pain right now. Uh, Alright. I got my, my roly near me. Alright. Oh! It wasn't as bad as I thought it would be. Ow. Ugh, okay. Let me get her going. Come on now. Hello. Hi. It's ready. Okay. Let me get on there. I'm using the chair <laughs> right now to get on there. Ow. All right, where am I at? <sighs> oh. 399.6 pounds. Woo, right about 400. Man, I gained 20 pounds back. That's what I thought. Lord have mercy. Well, we have a starting point. Oh. Whew. Alrighty. Hey y'all. Today, <laughs> today is day one of diet days. Um, January 4th, 2024. Um, yeah, my last weigh-in was on the 1st. I haven't weighed in today. I'll probably weigh in tomorrow, but um, the weigh-in... Oh, yeah, I just woke up. It's like after 6 p.m. I just woke up. <laughs> so, I'm like, I look crazy. But um, I figured, being as I'm getting started today, I might as well just say hi. Even if, you know, I'm not all fixed up or whatever. This is raw unfiltered candy um <laughs> so yeah so it's after 6 p.m and i stayed in bed for as long as possible just to like get a good start you know kind of a, a fast like with without the actual work <laughs> just kind of sleep through it um i haven't eaten since midnight last night um so yeah, <laughs> it's been a while. It's been um, 18 hours since my last meal. Uh, so that's a pretty good start. Um, I'll record whatever I decide to eat this evening. <coughs> Not ordering out. The last time I ordered out was last night about 11 p.m. I got the food and I was done eating by midnight and I was like this was it that was it I didn't do a mukbang of it either I just freaking pigged out <laughs> you know I went out with a bang so the the way in that I did on the first I could weigh even more than that right now you know we'll see <coughs> I'll put in both weigh-ins <laughs> Fridays and um the first i was um 399.6 in that way in so i was still under 400 <laughs> so god knows if i'm gonna be now or not i don't know but anyway today i'm having probably just some meats and vegetables maybe some you know a little fat in there some butter or whatever olive oil you know but uh, uh that's gonna be it for a little while i'm gonna try really really hard to stay away from carbs at least for the next 30 days 
Um, <laughs> I mean, I have, I have a lot of carbs in the house and I'm not getting rid of my carbs because, <clears throat> you know, I'm going to be going back to just eating, you know, regular food, <laughs> not keto, keto vor, whatever kind of food. Um, I'm still going to try to cook whole foods as much as possible, you know, as much as possible and not be ordering out because I don't want to be wasting money and stuff, you know, and that's just wasteful. It's just really freaking wasteful. Um, there's no reason for it unless I'm, unless I'm specifically going to shoot a fast food mukbang for those fast food views. <laughs> Because they do get the views. I mean, if y'all look at, like, McDonald's and, and even the Jolly Bee video and stuff, those things get freaking views. And my home cooking videos, you know, they're, they're kind of like a womp womp <laughs> situation. <clears throat> but, you know, that's kind of what I'm going to try to do on the main channel, the Hungry Fat Chick channel, um, for at least this next 30 days is I'm going to try to to do either home cooking or if I do out food, which, you know, I can do out food, but it's certain things like maybe like El Pollo Loco, <clears throat> rotisserie chicken, <laughs> you know, there's things I could buy from the grocery store, you know, that's already, you know, cooked like grilled chicken and things like that. I mean, just whatever. I'll figure it out, <laughs> but you know, no fried foods, you know, um, if I do any kind of fast food, I'm just still really going to stay away from carbs. <clears throat> but anyway, so that's what I have to report for right now. Um, I'll probably shoot a little bit more vlog, <laughs> whatever, um, between now and tomorrow. Um, you know, I'll shoot my food and stuff like that. But anyway, see y'all a little bit. 397. It was 0.6. <laughs> I'm on here, but I forgot to record. <laughs> okay, that's it. This whole bag of uh, steak fajita meat is 240 calories. This whole bag of Fiesta style vegetables is 240 calories. Uh, this can of diced chili ready tomatoes is uh, 140 calories, I believe. So, doing something with that today. Uh, yep, yeah, it's day one of my new year, new me. <laughs> Alrighty. Also, I'm gonna use this taco seasoning. And I used a few squirts of this avocado oil. Oh, it's cooking up a little bit before I add the tomatoes. Mm. Tomatoes have carbs too. Okay. <laughs> See, that's what you got to watch out for. You got to watch out for the carbs, you know. Also, this Fiesta vegetable mix had beans in it. Um, and I, I wasn't paying attention, but <laughs> anyway, so this is not exactly low carb. I mean, it's low carb, but it's not really keto, I don't believe, um, because there's going to be like 24 net carbs in this whole situation. I could just have like a serving, but this is my one meal of the day. <laughs> so 24 net carbs. Yay. Looking pretty good. Just cooking down nice. I put the chili in, chili tomatoes in with a little squirt of water. Super high calorie, so I added sour cream to it, but it's light sour cream, so might not be too bad. But yeah, it's a little bit carby. <laughs> 40 something net carbs, but yeah, if I'm going low carb, that's not bad. Alrighty, that's it. <laughs> Thank you.